and we're going to keep this party rolling, up, baby. We got more to talk about. The Dallas Cowboys have hired their defensive coordinator, and his name is Mike Zimmer. This is this is one of the last of the Mohicans right here, boy. He was with us when we won. He is the last. He is the last of the Mohicans. He was with us when we won our last Super Bowl. Yeah. Right? He came to us as an assistant uh, in 94. And then 95, 96, he was a defensive backs coach. Right? And then he, you know, several teams, Atlanta. I think Minnesota was his last head coaching job two years ago. And then uh, he's been out with uh, Jackson State and Colorado as an advisor helping Dion on those teams. Absolutely. But, uh, man, it's, you know. I'm I'm excited about the hire, quite honestly. Um, yeah, yeah, me know. too. I wanted somebody else, but then when I thought about it, I think some of those other guys, like um, Rex Ryan, yeah. I think his personality is too big to be a D yeah. defensive coordinator here in Dallas. Yeah, for sure. You know, and it might be too big to be an assistant coach to Mike McCarthy. Exactly. You know, because people will always say, you know, whatever they're having a bad game with Al Rex. Yeah. You know, so yeah. I think Jerry. And uh, whoever did it, man, because uh, Zimmer is more low-key. And yeah. You won't even see Zimmer do nothing but work. Yeah, man. But I guarantee you, if you get Rex, you're going to see Rex on TV oh. as, as much as you see uh, he wants, Mike McCarthy. He wants it. He yeah, wants yeah, that so, attention. So I think Rex and Mike uh, Rabel and uh, who else was the other guy? Uh, who? Uh, Al Harris, I know, was in the conversation, but he's still here. Yeah, he yeah, he's still nowhere. here. Yeah. And actually, Dallas, uh, the commanders... I uh, asked for permission to talk to uh, Al Harris, and Dallas said no. I'd have said the same thing. Yeah, but now same thing, <clears throat> especially if he's going to be just go over there to be the defensive back coach. Yeah. Now, if he was going to go over there to be the defensive coordinator, I would, you know, you kind of got to let a guy for get sure. a promotion for sure. But to go sideways, I'd be like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Talk about a lateral people. move, nah, yeah, don't, don't even, I, I don't even want you to talk to him. And that yeah. I think that would have uh, that would have. We would have seen some some serious, you know, separation in the in the locker room. But I don't think it's a lot of it. a lot of guys on defense that yeah. uh, love I'm not that sure guy. he even uh, would have went because he got more ties with Mike McCarthy than yeah. he do uh, Dan, Dan Quinn. Quinn. Yeah, he does. Yeah, so, yeah, he does. He played with Mike McCarthy. Yeah, so I think Bay. he would have stayed. Yeah, but Dallas did the right thing. Like we ain't gonna even talk about it. Yeah, yeah. And I, man, I I'm so. I'm just excited. So that was a because, good move to keep him and to get Zimmer. With his demeanor and his attitude, I think he'll be uh, overall he'll be a better fit yeah. than uh, Rex Ryan and, and some of those other guys. Because I think Rex, especially Rex Ryan, yeah. he would have stayed in front of the camera and the microphone too much. Man, I, I think about that Minnesota coach. defense, man, yeah. and them linebackers. They it seems like Minnesota always had good linebackers. No way. Every and, year, a solid D line. You know, a solid defense throwing through ever since Mike Zimmer was up there. And even when he was here in Dallas, uh, yeah, we didn't have the uh, – when he was the defensive coordinator, you know, we had Tony Tobin and those guys. Yeah. They wasn't Charles Haley, but they were solid, yeah. man. Yeah, yeah. And he was, uh, he was very good. You know, we had a good solid I think he had Charles for one year. Yeah, one year, but one I'm year. just saying overall. Yeah, for sure. He had guys like Tony Tobin, Leon Lynn. Yeah. And those guys, and those guys were solid. Yeah, man. man. Solid. Yeah, man. So, he, yeah. I know he, he knows how to recognize talent. He knows how to coach him up, you know, and I just like the 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 idea of having a a, a, a tough team again and getting off of this yeah. finesse stuff, you know. Yeah, uh, I, you know, I want to see some hard hitting guys yeah, out absolutely. here, uh, some guys redirecting some of them big linemen instead of just getting bowled, you know, ran yeah. over constantly, man. Like, and I want to see him see have change, an influence man. in that war room on draft day. Yeah, because some of these guys we've been getting lately, Nazi Smith and. Uh, I'm gonna say express for him. Yeah, he's, he, bus. I don't think he go. He gonna have to really work to pan yeah, out. Uh, bus. I mean, he yeah. he didn't even look. He looked little when I when I first saw him. I was like, oh, he's too little. But then not only it's not even being little, it's how slow he gets out of his stance. Yeah, the players being the players in progress, and you are just now getting out your stance. Reaction time he is just terrible. Brutal. I and he, never, he the closest one to the ball. Yeah, I never saw anybody. That <laughs> coming off the ball that slow, it's like I no mean, anticipation. Not on like, the, I mean, I, I, I'm not gonna say ever, but I'm saying on that level, yeah, you know, in high yeah. school, quite naturally, or college or something, but on that level, come on, it's man. not expected from a first round pick, especially a first round pick, yeah. yeah. And you can't, and they say you're gonna be a run stopper, but if you're still in your stance and they and they engage in you and you still coming out your stance, 
They're already the one. I never saw it. I never saw it when they drafted him. I just I saw his size and where we looking at him to play mm. and what we need. He too small now. He, I really now didn't if he hear puts his on name. About thirty during the during the college season. No, the, no, the, no, during during the college season, you heard his name, so I didn't hear his name at all. But during this season, at all, at other than all. what people was talking bad about, I I I saw him. Trot on the field, yeah, and I saw him trot <laughs> off the field. But I, I didn't see him in the cage in the play. Didn't <laughs> get done. Nothing done, man. Just getting driven off the yeah. ball, man. So, yeah, no. So, so it, maybe Mike Zimmer, like you said, he's a good evaluator of talent. Yeah. So hopefully he have a have some influence in that war room on who Dallas drafted, yeah. especially yeah. on the defensive side and all that. And that linebacker position where we need it the most, man. We absolutely yeah. need it the most.